huge issue inside the Liberal Party. And there are very active discussions going on and negotiations going on. You know, one of my, anybody who's seen my business card, one of my favorite quotes that of, you know, I ascribe to, to Jimi Hendrix is, uh, knowledge speaks, wisdom listens. And that's the, I think that that has been the strength of the Liberal Party over the years, is that they're willing to go out and listen. The best ways, really, is to change the electoral system so that they feel that their vote actually counts. Right now, and, and thank goodness, young people, they, they are more community-minded. Like they, they are hopeful. They, they know, my children said to me, and I have a great amount of hope in this next generation, because my children said to me, Mom, if it's not better for everybody, it's just not better. They get it. They get it. They know that, like, we, we were kind of brought up the dog eat dog, what's in it for me, you know? If you don't go and get it, you're going to be left out. They don't think of it that way. And I think there's a huge hope with that generation. So electoral reform is one thing, so they don't feel that their vote is wasted. And they, because look, we have a government that doesn't reflect the will of 65% of the people in this nation. Yeah, that doesn't encourage people to get involved. So we need some changes, I think. I think if anybody's going to be able to connect with young people, it's going to be Justin. He gets it. And he speaks the same way. So I was just mentioning that you see, it seems like a lot of the media, whether it's the Ottawa Citizen or the Kanata Courier or CFRA or any other one, is quite bluish in nature. And he's absolutely, and he's absolutely right. And how do we, how do we go out there and, and get our message out, out to the people of Kanata Carlton if we don't have any access to these, these kind of typical media channels. Um, the thing is, it's door to door. Uh, a nomination race, as you can see on that, on that pamphlet, I've been working now here for four years. Nomination race will bring in more memberships because the only way you win is to sign up more members, right? But it doesn't mean it's really helpful towards winning the next election. Because we're spending all of our time talking to people who are already, we know, are leaning liberals, and we're just getting them to take a membership. But what we really need to be doing is getting out there and talking to people who may not be liberals. And it, it, it's about building that trust, building so that relationship. What we need is a huge crew of volunteers. And that's why I, I haven't stopped. Um, in these last four years is training and recruiting volunteers because when you know, like as soon as this nomination race is over, then we're we're out there. We're, we'll be canvassing all winter long, knocking on people's doors and getting that message out there. Because you're right, the media environment isn't exactly the friendliest for us. <laughs>